flight modes and positions. All you need to do is go to the flight modes. Here you have all the flight mode uh, programs or list. As you can see. Now you need to add it to the positions. So go back and go to the dual rate. Now, dual rate, you have the aileron, you have the rudder, elevator, and auxiliary if you want. You need to put position to each uh, channel. Let's say for the aileron, you need to go to positions and you need to add extra positions you see now i add position 10 you have only three zero one two you need you'll need to add position three and then you have another uh, uh, flight mode you need to add position four position five six seven eight nine you have up to uh, 20 or something now when you finish with this you need to go back to rudder and do the same thing you need you'll need to add another position to the flight mode you you've just added the same with the same with the elevator and you can see if you have any now when you're done with the positions you'll need to go to this switch now you need to uh, fix the positions and the dual rates to the flight modes you, you've just uh, added so let's say I have the level flight uh, which is here well now I want to add the roller of course you know how to work with all the flight modes uh, um, which one is first and um, now I want to um, put the position and to uh, uh, assign it to the specific flight mode uh, I want to use the same thing with each and every uh, channel you're using now let's say I want to use the rudder sorry Go to the positions. Okay, now we add all the positions. Go here and how, let's say I've added the position three. I go here and if you want a specific a switch, you, you can add a switch. If you have a specific flight mode, you can add a flight mode. You can use the logic which is or and off and or on and you can use analog switch uh, to work it with now like I've said you need to do it in each and every channel thank you